everybody, my name's Chris, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Eleven, the Zero's Revenge, and it's the Pyramid Level 1. Hooray! Alright, so in the last episode, we uh, we met the Mystic again. She told us where the princess was, which is weird because, I mean, it turned out to be Nazira, which, you know, it wasn't really too surprising. Look at this freaking Sphinx, is just all smiley and stuff. What does this guy say? No one may enter the Great Pyramid without the two chronicles of the dead <gasps> chronicles of the dead what does that mean oh no so i guess that's a bit of a hint i guess i, w I was saying last episode we get a choice between three things to do in this level but that's i guess that's not true i guess this is still like kind of like a little mini hub world which is cool i like when games have like hub worlds in the middle of the game that are just kind of temporary so i guess we get the cho choice between two things to do in this uh, level. So let's go into this pyramid first. Look at this ancient Egyptian art. Ooh, I love these seven pixels. The pyramid is level three. Oh, okay, I chose the wrong one. Lion's very happy about the pyramids, though. He's very happy. The tourist is like, yeah. Oh, this place. Oh God. Yeah, this is nostalgic. This is actually the first time I felt really nostalgic. So I start playing. Oh, this! I forgot about that. So, uh. You don't get free stuff here. As you'll see, there's a snake dude over here, and he's sneak. or he's sleepy sleeping. I don't know what these are, though. Are they like daggers? They look daggers. But you'll see the snake start to wake up. What happens when it. Oh, yeah, they shoot. It shoots you, and then, um. Okay, that's right. You gotta sneak. Alright. Wow, how did it not wake up? I really want the last two. There you go. So I guess these are, they're like flaming daggers, because this shows kind of a little artwork here of how that works. Oh, that did that open this door? It did. Wow, this is so nostalgic. I think I want this last one. Ah! Oh, it immediately woke up. I didn't know that happens. I think it'd be like the guard, where you could like kind of, you know, uh, run in, and as he's waking up, you can continue grabbing stuff. But no, apparently not. It's escaped real quick. Like, yeah, they kind of cave in the door behind you, which is kind of weird. But you know, what ifs? There's a flame-breathing snake. It's kind of weird. This guy. I hate him! You scared me! I'm gonna curse you! Or something! And uh, I believe... I killed him and there were some of the body parts remain. I think if the hand was there, it would start to crawl towards you. Oh, there's a refill. I have my daggers in here. This one's for four free! Woo! I thought the flicking torches aren't messing with it. I like how the doors are just like little... They're just black. Oh, well that one doesn't look as bad, but the other ones, it's like, you can just clearly see it's like an actual kind of door there. There we go. So I guess this is all kind of about conserving your, uh, fire there. Okay. Can we push this? Hieroglyphs on the walls are really cool too. I wonder, are the actual pyramids, I know they obviously have hieroglyphs in them, but are they like, is there this much in the actual pyramids? Like, are they on every single wall, everywhere in it, or is it just kind of... Oh yeah, these guys. I was gonna say, I remember making a funky sound when they attacked. Yeah, there we go. I've always wondered that though, like, is there just one wall where there's a bunch of hieroglyphs, or are they like all over the place, like, like this pyramid? Oh, wow, I cannot hit this guy. Did I hit him? I'm hitting. Oh. There we go. You just gotta be prepared, apparently. Although these guys do look really freaking cool, I will admit. Hard. Three hits. So it's probably four or five. There we go. I wonder if the jump attack does extra damage, I doubt it. <laughs> this guy kinda looks like Moses or something. <laughs> I don't know why I'm thinking of Moses. Yeah, look at this door. It's like just, just a black screen. <laughs> Checkpoint! Checkpoint! So oh, genie. 
Some coffins kind of keep me a little bit too. Is there anything down here? I remember playing this level like before school as well. Gem? Ah! See, look at that! Well, how did I remember that? I remember there being like a jumping down area and doing a gem. Like I said, I haven't played this in like 10 years. At least. A decade ago! That's one eighth of someone's lifespan. I haven't played this game. And especially because, like, it's like, you know, when you're a kid, you don't have as great as a memory, right? This room is also cool, too. With all stars above you, the fake stars. I hope that's supposed to just be a. Those are just supposed to be painted stars, not like the actual night sky. Uh, I guess it wouldn't make sense for them to be painted stars. Anyways. Alright. I remember there being a gemstone on one of these ledges as well, but not might might not even be in this area. Go in a future area. So that still reminds me of Twilight Princess a bit. Uh, I don't remember what temple that is. I guess maybe the water temple where you have to hook shot everywhere and there's like little ledges you can stand on like that. There's little wheels spinning around. There's a snack in here? Is there a snack? Oh, they're just on a timer. Yeah. Is that like open? No, it's not like that one game. Let's go through it or something. Oh, right, the key. I forgot I got that. Oh, jeez! I like stop breathing fire. That's weird. It, like spurts it out. Oh snap! It's a snack. Nails here. Nope. Get poisoned. Good, good, good. Oh, I only use one. What? Okay, so apparently some pot spawning these. Don't like it. Don't like the hurts. I think it's either like gross ass too. Did the hand stick around? Oh, I chopped off his hand. Where's his hand at? Maybe I killed it already. Alright, well. I guess some pots spawn enemies. I forgot about that. I guess because it's not very significant. <laughs> oh, the black screen. I don't know why I land sometimes. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's it's uh, levels version of the car. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa! Jeez, this is like a minotaur. That's pretty cool. Oh, jeez! How many freaking tents do you take, dude? There we go. I don't know how many. I think I had to hit him maybe twice in a row or three times in a row or something. I've had my life. Not a big fan. I got to admit. I'm pretty sure this gave me a lot of trouble as a kid. Figuring out what to do with this. Even though it's fairly obvious. Then again, those don't really look like daggers, do they? Like on the right side of the screen there. Those golden daggers. They're supposed to represent daggers on fire. But to me, it does not look like that at all. Oh, this. Room. I'm pretty sure there's a gem in here as well. Top of one of these, maybe. That was a genie token. I could see through it. <laughs> Just gotta use that. My advantage. Oh, I like how it also has the, uh... Watch, watch the side of this platform that's moving around. It has the wings on it. The person with the wings. I don't actually, I don't know what it's called. That's really cool to me. Alright, so I take it. We have to go over here. Um, there's no harm in doing this now, right? Let's see, I don't want to do this and have someone activate that I can't stop. Alright. Okay. So these, like... Guards holding up these towers are really weird looking. Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, oh, dang it. Double dang it. Double dang it. I think, well, I mean, I got the genie token. Is there anything else up there, though? This I do not know. It's weird that they would have, like, a bridging platform to it as well. There's nothing. Oh, maybe I could jump to it from here. Can I do that? Take a look. Oh, I didn't even get the genie token. I thought I got it. Oh, I'm so silly. I can totally do that. Okay, so it's just an alternate path, I see. Yeah. Oh, I see, and then you're supposed to use this tool this way. Alright. I don't know if you can defend- I guess you can't maybe defend against him. Yeah, I think hitting him is what activates the, this attack. <laughs> His foot. His foot came off. Pretty morbid, man. Pretty morbid. Oh, these don't respawn. That's how that works. Okay, that's why there's less there. Alright, so I mean, this is like a pressure switch. Is it not? Come back down? 
not missing anything else in this room, right? All right, cool. Genie lamp. Oh yeah, we got genie back now, so we can see these again. I forgot about that. Gem question mark? There it goes. Thor she blows. There's two. Oh, there's no coins though. Interesting. You think that it would be all things, especially considering like we're in a pyramid. Oh. Now really. Who would go and leave a cat statue sitting precariously on a ledge like that? Well, that's not a hint or anything. I don't know what that hint means. I guess we need to get the cat statue up is what that probably means. Does it go back down? No. It's not a timer. No, it's not slowly going back down or anything. Alright, so it looks like we gotta catch this. Goes down. So it hasn't moved yet. I remember that. I kind of, I very vaguely remember the cat statue. I don't remember what the heck it does though. So maybe when it sees you, it goes down or something. Oh no! You just gotta push onto the switch, don't you? Go up. So go up, 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 go up. I'm on fire. It is going down. Dang it! Oh, I see. You gotta get it on that switch. Yeah. Hopefully that activated enough. Yes, it did. Okay. No! Ooh! Holy crap! All right. Worked out. No, I can't make that jump. Yes! <gasps> no! Well, that's okay. It's up there now. It's up there now. There's nothing you can do, giant emerald cat statue thing. I'm always like looking around. I don't blame him in a creepy ass pyramid with the torches lit for some reason. Who lit these torches? Who did it? Is there a freaking robber in here? Ooh, I guess I gotta consider this will also go down. Why is it? Maybe it's because the cat's off and it's not going down anymore. Because the weight isn't on it. The weight of the world's on your shoulders. Alright. Hallelujah! Oh yeah, now it's... Oh, that... Yeah, those are raising up. Is this the thing of the dead? I don't freaking know. Let's find that out, shall we? Yeah! The something of the dead. I know that's what we we're looking for. I don't know if that's. Hey, coins! This doesn't look like a trap at all or anything. It's not a trap? There's four coins. Apparently, I missed a coin. It's behind me. No, it's not. Hey, right, well, don't know where that last coin is. Maybe there's something through here. Maybe this isn't just the end of the level. No, it's the end of the level. Huh! Don't know where that fifth. Oh, what? Did not just say four to five coins? I swear it did. Weird. Six lives, six extra lives, go! Six, six lives, six extra lives. Well, one extra life. That's Way okay. to go! I don't know how many lives I'd boy into that. I feel like it was two. Do, 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 do. Well, I got one third Way of what I wanted. <laughs> Way to go! Let's see, oh yeah, we have a uh, bonus round now. So, you think Yay. you're a good shot, eh? I bet you can't splat ten zeros. Ten zeros? Ah, I did not hit that one. Ooh, I like when I'm accidentally hitting the ones in the background. That's always nice. Yeah, there we go again. Ooh, nope. No, oh, Chuck Testa. Oh, I got it somehow. All right. I don't know when the heck you I got that one on the right. Valuable the blue genie gem. A valuable blue germ germ. I love germ germs. Yay! Do you want to save? Yes. All right. Uh, good spot to call it up. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like on the video and by subscribing to my channel. Uh, if there's any games you want to see me play, the best way to recommend them to me is by checking out my description and clicking the video there, which will lead you to a video where you can suggest games for me to play, and the more common ones I will look into playing. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys later. Bye!